We seems like the gremlins that follow Jigger around are scared of Tingana. Because as soon as we managed to get in here, everything seems to be fine. Isn't this meant to be? <laughs> Hello. Um, from what we've seen from the night, well, Tingana is not too far from the tree where, where he tried to hoist that warthog yesterday. Um, we actually could only just see the stomach contents of the warthog uh, lying on the floor. So I'm sure the rest of the kill is here somewhere, but we've pretty much just arrived. So I'm sure he'll he'll show us at some point where he's keeping the rest of the warthog in. Although it was a pigling, I think there was quite a lot of meat in there for him to to have a look at, uh, to have a look, to have a bite. So I'm sure he's got the rest somewhere around here. But it seems like maybe he's been he's been having a tough night trying to balance that kill on top of that marula. I don't think it was the easiest marula were to leave a kill up there, but maybe he did manage to to finish it. We're gonna go on exploring a little later. Uh, it seems like for now he is very happily asleep and what a game of patience it was yesterday i still can't believe it you know this is probably why these animals are so successful and if i were a leopard i would probably die because i don't think i've got the patience that tingana showed to have yesterday i mean just on top of the termite mound for hours and he knew that a warthog was deemed to come in there so i wonder if when the other one didn't run off yesterday that didn't give away the position of some more warthog because we could hear some more squealing and other noises so maybe he knew all along what his plan was going to be Stevie, you say that he is beautiful. Well, he is a very stunning male leopard. He looks very healthy, especially yesterday when we just first saw him and I saw some of those screenshots of him in that golden light. I mean, it just gives you that idea of a very powerful creature, doesn't it? More like a kitty cat right now. <laughs> but we've also got to be able to see the soft side of our life every now and again. I think yesterday he pretty much gave us every visual of what a leopard can be regal and you know atrocious and powerful and magnificent and sleepy and uh, too many things all together and well this is how they spend the day after if he still got a bit of the kill somewhere around here that he stashed away somewhere maybe in the thick bush because I can't see anything else up in the tree um, likely he'll carry on feeding around here and also we're not too far away from one of the dams from treehouse dam so I'm sure if, if whenever he's feeling a bit thirsty all he has to do is walk a little five minute walk and then come back and then he'll be back on the kill so he's actually chosen a very good spot and I wonder how many times he's actually been hunting out here and known about all of these termite mounds that are a potential you know spot for him